the, diverse, the diversity has lessened, unfortunately. And I say that because um, not so much as the diversity in the school system, but the diversity from teacher positions. We don't get an opportunity to see a lot of um, blacks in the school system and other minorities, and especially when it comes to males. When I went through the school system, I think I had one classroom teacher that was a black male, and I had one that was a phys ed, so two, two teachers that were black males. Um, at this point, there's quite a few students that will go through the school system and they'll never be instructed by a black male. Um, and that was brought up recently, that even over the course of probably the last 10 years, we've seen some of our African-American um, classroom teachers decrease. And that's of great concern. A classroom teacher has to be able to relate to everyone in their classroom. Um, sometimes when I'm speaking to a black male, it doesn't take as much for me to relate to them because I've lived their life. It takes me a little bit more time to relate to someone that's been in, in different cultures, but I have to make every opportunity to make sure that I do that. But we need all of our teachers and all of our professionals to say, you know, whether I need to learn another culture or not to be successful, because that's actually what black males have to do and African Americans, we have to learn a totally different culture many times in order to be successful. Well, some people are feeling, I don't have to learn another culture to be successful. But we really need for every professional to make an extra opportunity to go out of your comfort area and to see what the other cultures are experiencing, listen to them, fill them out, and, and help pull people up from every arena because there's enough room for everyone to be successful and, and to do well. I think it has to start with um, allowing the teaching profession to be relevant to students and to be hip to students. If it is detached from my world, I won't have an interest in that profession. And so I think we really have to um, hone in on middle and high school students, look at the minorities, um, present the opportunity to them, and let them know um, the good side, not just the bad sides to education, um, and how you will have an opportunity to um, not only be a blessing to yourself and your family, because people often say that the pay is not good. It's really not enough, but it is a good salary, and it's enough to make a, um, a living off of and to take care of your family. So we have to be able to present it in such a light that people can see, and, and especially middle and high school students can see, that um, this is really a hip profession and people will allow you to be yourself. And that's one thing that I've really liked about Wacomico County. I don't feel like I'm in a box as an African American um, in, in Wacomico County. Wacomico County has allowed me to be who I am. And we need quiet teachers, we need loud teachers, we need outspoken teachers, we need reserved teachers um, because you relate to a lot of different students. Shy teachers, you know, the whole gamut, because there's gonna be um, students that are sitting in those seats that's gonna be able to relate to someone, and they won't relate to everyone, but they need to, to have a wide, a wide variety of teachers to be able to relate to. So when we allow our teachers to come in with their creativity and just be themselves, we, uh, we have the opportunity to reach a, a wider audience of students. I really hope things get better. I will say our county is doing what it can um, to reach out to a variety of venues, universities, um, to be able to be more diverse. Um, as far as me personally, I try to make sure that um, I represent African-Americans and African-American males in a professional light because I understand that I have one shot sometimes. These students will go through the school system and they may say, I had one African-American teacher my whole career. I don't get a chance to make a lot of mistakes because I can blow it for um, all races and, and all types of students. 
So I think it's extremely important that when a teacher is in a position, they have to do their very best to make sure they present themselves as professional and um, courteous and understanding, have a listening ear, and hopefully, if we just continue to reach our younger population and we present ourselves as professionals, as individuals that really care about these students and show we love them, this, the students will be able to um, look at our profession and say, you know what, I'm seeing how much they're helping people because they've helped me. Um, I'm hoping that we can make some changes and bring some more diversity to our county that way.